Mm, faster. Uh, uh. Anyone looking for a GF to do heat with? <laughs> like, bro, relax yourself. My God. I thought it couldn't get worse than gotcha heat, but I was so wrong. I like to be educated, but I'm so frustrated. Hello to my loneliness. I guess that ignorance is bliss. Take me back to before. Yep. This is what we're doing now. Emoji cat heat. If we go to the comments of this YouTube short here, which as far as I can tell, if we go to the description is not age restricted. I don't know if YouTube shorts can even be age restricted. I literally have no idea, but they would appear in the description of a regular YouTube video. So I would imagine it's not age restricted. People are just like, yes, daddy. Oh yeah, I love emoji cat heat. And if you go to any of these people's profiles and you just look at them, like there are, they just have videos where it shows their face and it's literally children. Like it's, this is a child right here. Obviously I'm gonna blur it out. I'm not gonna show you the name because that's insane, but there's no question. This is, it, there's no question that this is a children centered thing emoji cat heat. And from what I've been able to find, this applies to pretty much every emoji cat heat video ever. If you go in the comments and you look at the people and you find the people who are like, oh yes, daddy, oh, all that stuff. And we're like, oh, like flustered emoji. This is so exciting. I love this. It's all children. And that's insane. It's almost worse than gotcha life heat. I mean, like what you have just seen everyone is called emoji cat heat. What is emoji cat heat? What the hell? I don't even know what it is to be honest with you. Well, if we Google it, we get some incredible results. Um, this is all in SFW. I cannot show this on YouTube at all whatsoever, especially this middle one in this thumbnail that just pops up when you Google it. Feel free to try for yourself if you're not scared. Guys, I've perused and browsed the internet and I've been trying to figure out what emoji cat heat is. And the best that I can come up with as an explanation and correct me if I'm wrong is emoji cat heat basically is just taking a cat emoji and doing to it what gotcha life heat people do to gotcha life basically it's just a cat made of emojis there's no actual show there's no game there's no movie series there's no comic book series that ties all this together it's just cats made of emojis and like all good trends it seems to be mostly on tiktok made by children. So according to Urban Dictionary, the most accurate website on the internet, Emoji Cat is some emoji stuff no one cared about until the stupid children got their hands on it when it had actual potential. There is also rule 34 of this. Emoji Cat fan. Want to make a Emoji Cat video? Lua. No. Get the Emoji Cat mug. What? <laughs> it even has this Stupid description. <laughs> oh my god. Don't worry, there's a real definition here on, on Urban Dictionary. Emoji cat, an OC made out of overlapping emojis to look like an image of a cat. Lately, the trend has gained popularity by TikTok users adding emojis to TV characters to create an artwork. And one more description here. Emoji cat, a popular persona on the app of TikTok where users use a variety of emojis to create an OC that represents the shape of a cat. Now, the reason there's so much backlash with this specific community is the same thing the gotcha community is currently suffering through. This is cause is called emoji heat. Emoji heat works the same way as gotcha heat does. Now, mainly, the unfortunate pro of this is that it's a lot more easier to represent heat on emojis, which that apostrophe is completely unnecessary because it's a plural, it's not a possessive. So shut the hell up and learn grammar because they give a better POV instead of gotcha heat. The other issue with this is that emoji heat makes up at least 51% of the whole community. Basically a huge problem to the pure side safety. See, this is accurate, this apostrophe, because guess what? That's a possessive. The safety belongs to the pure side. It's the pure side apostrophe s safety that makes sense is not a plural however going to the examples example one lao i personally use emoji cats that should not be there that apostrophe that is a plural not a possessive you are an idiot to express my creativity of ocs once again that apostrophe should not be there i swear no one no one went to school like literally i love how they have a, an exact percentage of how much the emoji cat heat is affecting the pure side of it. I love how there's, they have, they know the exact percent of people that are doing this and causing the problem. So now we know that emoji cat heat is basically just gotcha life heat repackaged in a different community. You know what I mean? I swear, am I losing my freaking mind or are children just like 10 times more than ever before. Like what the hell, man? There was nothing like this when I was a kid. At least nothing I knew about, you know, <laughs> like what the hell, man? I swear the internet is just a never ending mine.
basically. It just churns out one community after the other, and they're all just like, wow. So the biggest channel in Emoji Cat Heat right now is called Emoji Cat Heat, and they upload these Emoji Cat Heat compilations. So let's take a look at one right now, shall we? Emoji Cat Heat compilation by Emoji Cat Heat. 15.8 thousand subscribers. Okay, this video has 317,000 views, and they have a description that has tags, which is actually, that's actually pretty smart way to do YouTube. So this shows me that they know what they're doing on YouTube because when you put things in the description that's like the second title to YouTube you want to put things that are relevant to what's happening in the video and almost use it as tags because actual tags don't really do anything anymore you want to have it in the description so like this is pretty smart this shows that they know what they're doing they literally know what they're doing and the fact that gotcha heat is on here I mean that just says everything you need to know about the emoji cat heat hi heat makers that's that's the name of their community is the heat makers oh my god why didn't I just stay off of YouTube, man. If you want to be in the next compilation, send me your emoji cat heat on Discord. And there's the freaking Discord. I'm not even, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna blur that out. Wow. I can only imagine what illegal stuff goes on in that Discord and horrible things happen to actual literal children in that Discord. <laughs> So this one has like, it's very dim, but if you brighten the screen, you can see what's happening. And it is, it is definitely like adult content. You know what I mean? And it's just on YouTube here. It's not age restricted at all whatsoever. And if you look really, really closely up at the top here, it says in the smallest text in the world, not for kids. In the world's smallest text. Thanks for letting me know. Thank you. Very nice. I'm sure that will really prevent children from watching this. Absolutely. I wish I knew. See this one right here? These are all things where like, it's too dark to see it on the actual video, but if you brighten it up in a, in a video editing program, you can see what's happening. Or if you just watch it on a screen that's bright, you can see what's happening. But I can't see it on my main monitor, but I can see it on what OBS is capturing while I'm recording this video. So I, I'm literally recording my screen with software and on the software I'm recording my screen with, I can see what's happening, but I can't see it in the actual video. So what, what? This is how people are avoiding the YouTube algorithm shutting their video down is by making it dim enough where you have to brighten your screen to see what's happening. And then they tell you, oh, brighten your screen. And then you can see the adult activity as a child. It's kind of spooky that that's a thing. You know what I mean? That's kind of like 5D level chess thinking there to get around the algorithm. And if you try to do this on this video, I, I have put black boxes over everything that you would be able to see if you brighten the screen up because I don't want you to be able to see that on this video. Trigger warning! Don't do lighter the screen, please. It would be bad for yours eyes. It would be bad for yours eyes. Yes, absolutely. Exactly what you think is happening is happening right there. That shadowing figure is performing something upon that person or emoji cat, I guess. Not a person. My God. Pretty much all these are just the, the same thing where it's like, oh, you have to brighten your screen to see it. And that's how they get around the TikTok al algorithm and the YouTube algorithm. And there needs to be something done about that. You know what I mean? I think the YouTube algorithm should boost the brightness of every video and run it through a second time. That is how the YouTube algorithm should work. That could be, that could prevent all this from happening right here. Is YouTube going to do the right thing? No, probably not, but we'll see. It's hilarious, okay? But it's also like really messed up. You know what I mean? Like, it's funny to joke about, it's funny to laugh at, but this is a serious problem. Like it's it's actually, it's kind of horrifying. And if we scroll down more, this person says, oh, me please, mm, faster, uh, uh. Anyone looking for a GF to do heat with? <laughs> like, bro, relax yourself, my God. Flustered emoji, ah, uh, 110 kisses, oh my.
God. You just, I don't know, man. It just really, it, it doesn't get any worse than this. I mean, this is the worst on YouTube, I think, that exists, to be honest with you. This is worse than Gotcha Life Heat. This is worse, because it's straight up, literally, it's straight up just showing the actual action. Whereas Gotcha Life Heat, sometimes, most of the time, will tiptoe around it, but like, this actually just shows straight up the action happening. My God. I didn't think we would find anything worse than Gotcha Life Heat, but here we are. Thank you to my patrons and channel members. You can become a channel member, click that join button, you can become a patron by joining in the description down below. Support the channel, all that stuff. They're all here on your screen. Thank you, channel members and patrons. Amazing people, love you. What do you think of Emoji Cat Heat? Let me know in the description comments, rather, down below. Let me know what you think. I'm curious, I don't know. Is it worse 